We talked about DNA double strand breaks yesterday, and today let's talk about how the cell repairs those. And there are two major ways. One is called non-homologous adjoining, and the other one is homologous recombination. Both of those terms have the word homologous in them. So let me first of all explain what that means. Homologous means um, being related to or having the same structure. And that's um, the meaning uh, that is used in the biology. The uh, two things are homologous when they share, um, when they have very similar structures, but not necessarily the function. So, um, what we use homologous mainly when we talk about uh, chromosomes. So, we remember that uh, there are 46 chromosomes in all cells in the human body except for the sex cells, which are oocytes and sperm. Those have just one copy, one set, which is 23 chromosomes. So, basically, every other cell, which are called somatic cells, they have two sets of uh, DNA. And um, so, those 23 chromosomes are the 22. Um, that are the same um, in the two different sets and one sex chromosomes. So girls have um, X and X and boys have X and Y. And the Y, that is the sex chromosomes that comes from their dads and X comes from the mom. So, um, all right. So those, each chromosome, say chromosome 5, uh, in the set that comes uh, from the mom, is homologous to chromosome 5 in the set that comes from the dad. This doesn't mean that they're identical. In fact, um, there can be quite some variation. However, they're very, very, very similar. And uh, if, say, um, the, we have a double strand break and the chromosome is severed into two parts, so we have two pieces of um, DNA molecule, right? So the first way of how the cell repairs the cell, uh, the double strand break, is, uh, which is uh, non-homologous in joining, it means that it doesn't use homology, it doesn't use the homologous chromosome, it doesn't need to, to repair the break, and in this case the two um, ends are simply fused um, they kind of stick together, kind of, kind of like glued together. Um, the other way of the double strand breaks repair, the homologous recombination, actually requires the homologous uh, chromosome. And when um, they are aligned, there is um, quite a complicated process that is going on, but uh, it's important to understand that the break is repaired using the information stored in the other, the homologous chromosome, which is supposed to be kind of like the same, and it often is. Um, and that homology is used in order to uh, repair the double uh, strand break um, as accurate as possible.